everybody, it's Maron. Welcome to another edition of FWB Friday Wine Benefits. Hooray! It's Friday and hooray! It's International Women's Day. And I'm dedicating this post today to women in wine internationally and, of course, here in Australia. Internationally, in Champagne, we can't go past people like Madame Clicquot or Lily Bollinger. In the UK, Jansen Robinson, who's a very esteemed wine critic, wine journalist, wine writer. But more importantly, right here in Australia, I love to mention people that have really left an indelible mark and leaving an indelible mark in the wine industry. I can't go past, firstly, Pam Dunsfield. Pam is really absolutely incredible because there's a lot of firsts when it comes to her. Uh, for example, she is the first woman in Australia to get an enology degree, the first woman wine judge in Australia, the first woman to do vintage at Krug, the first woman to occupy a senior winemaking position um, to Chapel Hill. Uh, we can't go past people like Diana Cullen from Cullen Estate in Margaret River, Prue Henschke from Henschke Estate, Sue Hodder, who's the chief winemaker at Wins, uh, Kathleen Keeley from Keeley Estate, who's the first person to grow Pinot Gris in Australia, Kerry Thompson from KT Wines, Sarah Crow is a legend at, at Yarra, Yarra Yering, Melanie Chester at Giant Steps uh, in the Yarra, Joe Marsh from Billy Button, the list goes on. But here is to celebrating Woman in Wine. Thank you for what you've done for us here in the wine industry in Australia. Until next week, have an awesome weekend.